All praises, all honor, all glory be unto Yahweh, Bahashem Yahushai, Bahashem Rakakodash. Double honors to the apostle elders of Great Millstone that rule well, and peace and salutation to Allah Akim doing and pushing this word in all honesty, truth, and sincerity worldwide, and a sincere shalom to the elect. Now, this one I want to get into. I sent this to a couple brothers. I put this in my um, was it the community post? Right, put this in the community post, and you know, just left it from there. Like, you brothers could go check it out. I labeled it this while well, watch and listen up, hired agents. Okay, it's an ex FBI informant talks infiltration of black culture. Black culture is just dead. Okay, our God is our God is not the God of the uh, dead, but of the living, man. And that black culture bullshit, black unconsciousness. We ain't black. We're Israelites. We got a nation. Okay? We're, we're Israelites, all right? So going back into this, when I seen this, I just remembered what Apostle Elder Tahar and Gabar, Aramla, Rakar, all of them always warned us about, man. There's fucking agents out here, okay? And they out for no good. They out to get you tied up in shit, you know? Get your name mucky, get any type of dirt on you. We'll discuss what he talks about the black desk. That 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 really is going into the black desk. Okay. But here it is. <coughs> this uh video here. Somebody said at uh around the ten and eleven minute mark, man. I, I forget. But uh, you know, note it. Note it down on a piece of paper. That when you get to about the uh ten minute, eleven minute mark, in between nine and twelve. Somewhere in between there, he says something really, really juicy, okay? I can't remember what it is, but, um, you know, I was supposed to do this video a couple of days ago, but, you know, the spirit, and now I'm doing it, okay? So, this is another one right here, countering the conspiracy to destroy black boys. It really is right, Israelite men, okay? Because what it is is Esau versus Jacob. All right, it's us versus them. That's the real war, the real battle in this world right now. Okay, these guys thinking about Iran, Iraq, Russia, and USA. No, 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 no. The real battle, the real tough nugget is, you know, uh, Jacob versus Esau, man. Uh, the light versus the darkness. Um, the righteousness versus wickedness. Okay. That's the real back right now in, in, in this world. But these people, they don't they don't really understand that. They don't have no understanding of it, right? But we can see it. The Lord gave us these scriptures, put that spirit in us to know these things, note them, and, and cite them out and say, look, 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 you see, this is what it is, this is what it is. But the rest of the people in the world are not hearing these things because, you know, the Lord's not working with them. This is like my last video. This is not their diet, okay? It's not part of their diet. And even if you try spoon feeding them, they'll throw up. Okay? They're not accustomed to what we eat. We eat bitters. Okay? Hot, bitter food. Right? <laughs> Anyways, so going back into this. Yeah, they've been trying to do that. Emasculate the young young men and turn them womanish. And we're afraid. We speak bowling. We're afraid, afraid of you crabs out there, right? Oh, oh, Sutherland, 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 that's, that's one of the dude's names, when he had said that, I said, yeah, Sutherland, hmm, Sullivan, yeah, Sullivan, David Sullivan, or something like that, but anyways, here's another one. Black Panther Party undercover agent, okay, FBI, ghetto informer program, see these, uh, Richard Okoye, or Kale, or whatever his name is, uh, uh, committed a revolutionary or FBI informant, whatever. And this right here, the man who exposed the Crips, Bloods, and CIA connection to crack cocaine. <laughs> yeah, this shit is real, man. This shit is real. You think these people are joking? They got tabs on us. When when Apostle the Tahar and them tell us, look, these motherfuckers got tabs on you, Y'all doing this work? Best be careful. Because these guys are not playing. 
Co and Tell, Tell and Co. <laughs> Co and Tell, Tell Co. Whatever. These niggas ain't playing. They're not joking. Okay? And they're very good at what they do. All right? We're dealing, we're dealing with, we're dealing with the, uh, the sons of Satan. All right? <laughs> True thing. Now, yeah, going back into this black desk, just like I was saying, they know what you're doing. This faggot, yo. Nigga, get the fuck off my block, you fucking bitch. Fuck out of here, bro. Went home and changed your shirt. How long is this guy gonna keep listening to this Coolio shit, bro? God damn, bro. Fuck out of here, man. It's lucky, eh? They probably called him right now and said, go back, go back. <laughs> Anyways, the Black Death. When this man talks, I don't want to play this video. Because I don't know if I'm going to get another uh, copyright. He's... <coughs> the way YouTube's been acting lately, it's lucky. Oh, man. For the slightest thing, we get knocked. All right? You won't be uploading nothing for the next seven days, nigga. <laughs> That's how they get with us, man. And sometimes it's frustrating, you know? You go upload a video. It's not uploading for the whole day. It's taking like two, three hours, four hours, five, nine hours. So you, what do you do? This is real. This has happened to uh, uh, this happened to me. This has happened to a lot of brothers. This happened a couple years back too, where for some odd reason they would slow down our fucking um, the black desk man. Listen, where they would slow down our fucking um, uploading speed or whatever it may be. How does it be, man? We just paid it. My woman paid the fucking bill. We just paid the fucking bill. Everything's in good standing. What, what's going on here? Got a got a new uh uh what do you call that router and all that shit. Bring the fucking uh cable man out. Fixed all the wires and shit. Still. Are you kidding me? Remember, Ephesians uh six and twelve, man. But anyways. How is it that we're trying to upload a video? I remember Apostle Elder Gabar was talking about this a couple weeks back, or maybe like a month or a couple weeks back. And a couple other brothers. But how am I trying to upload a video? And the video won't upload for the whole damn day. Sometimes two days. You got to pull down the video and try again. You can try with like a little short video. And even that's like still hell. And it, it ain't no uh, two hour video. Five hour video. Just to explain one little situation. No. These like 20 minute videos, 15 minute videos, 30 minute videos, the regular shit. Anyways, so going across this, the Black Death. The perfect interlude, the Black Death. Okay, when he talks about this, he goes, there's many Black Deaths across the world. And they monitor everything. Everything. Okay? Every blood clot, everything that go across the airways, sent away his phones, every fucking thing. Or uh, uh, new organizations popping up. Everything they monitor, Zin. Not just, oh, you're uploading this. No, they want to know who you're talking to. They want to know what you're watching. And this is back then. How much more now? This is in the 80. What is it? Hold up. Let me see. Uh, see something here? It's 80s, some 1980. Uh, yeah, original interview aired in the 1980. So it could have been all 70s, this. I mean, 79, 78, where the actual interview took place, and then they aired it, 19, because remember, back then, things were way different, you'd have to wait five years for one new movie to come out, now you have new movie come out every, every, every fucking two weeks, right, back then you have to wait a, a, a good, good, oh, fuck, for it to come on VHS or anything, you have to have big money, and when it come on VHS, pre-order, all them thing there, but anyways, so this black that's what they're talking about here and, and that's at the 20 20 of mark 20 around there somewhere i mean i have this recorded but i just don't want to play it because i i don't really need another fucking strike but <laughs> so anyways and fuck youtube anyways we ain't gonna be on this much long this black that's what they're talking about here okay everything crosses it man so what you're doing they got everything we do on the net. 
if, if you ordered pizza, if you ordered fucking uh, anything from Amazon, best believe you Hebrew Israelite, they got you. They got a list on all of us, okay? Guaranteed fucking T, they got a list on all of us. That's why you see people like um, Polite and all these other niggas that said some weird shit about us. Come on, bullshit, man. They would you be underneath the fucking jail. You wouldn't even exist no more. If those are true things, talking about we go around and great people, the grape gang. Get the fuck out of here, man. But anyways, when you Akim get a chance, go check this out. You seen what the, oops, you seen what the title is. And if you don't know, you got an iPhone. You can do this. All right. And you can copy it, select it, and put it in and. Whoop -de -whoop. All right, so let's go into this real quick. Oh, Romans 6 10. I started out with that in the last one. Salakia. Yeah. Once again, Romans 16 and 17. Now I, I beseech you, brethren, mark them which cause divisions and offenses contrary to the doctrine which ye have learned, and avoid them. Because they're going to bring in new things some people might not wonder they might not you know a little leavening that's all it takes a little leavening and it make the whole bread swell up right so these little fbi informant agents they want chaos they want they want something to bring back to the man oh when you go there too listen when he talks about bonuses you know somebody special comes in like say we're um say we're all uh Say we're all uh, holding camp, and then all of a sudden, like, let me say it like this. Say I, uh, all right, watch this. Say there was a, a camp talking on the street. We're not going to call no names, nothing. And let's say, like, Nate or Tahar showed up to that camp. Just, just showed up like, hey, how's it going, guys? This is down the street. I seen you guys. I was gro grocery shopping. Could be anybody. Zabak, Tahar, you know, even you. Put yourself, put your own self in the situation. Me, anybody. Put yourself in the situation, okay? But the reason why I said like Tahar or Zabak or you know what I mean because they've been out there so long. Well, starting with Apostle Tahar first of all, but. Camp leader, head leaders, right? And then on top of that, no. They show up at the camp. And when they show up at the camp, the informer, the, the, the agent, sees them there. He knows that his hours are a certain, you know, he got to tap out, right? But then, it's called the bonus hour, or bonus, the bonus time, whatever. He sees... Let's say, you know, whoever. Zabak or somebody. He's like, oh, shit. Zabak is here, yo. So we'll stay around extra. That's called a bonus time or whatever. To try and get more dirt. Because somebody else, somebody big time showed up. You understand? You understand what I'm saying? To them. This guy's been out there. He's, you know, he's been. He's one west. He, uh, you, know, you know what I mean? So they would stay, stick around and be like, yeah, let's see what else we can get. You know, that's called the bonus, bonus time. In fact, I think this was, uh, slack in one second, right here. Bonuses were paid. I, I think that's part, part of it. Okay. I never, I never tapped on the shorts. I didn't mind with that, you know. So going back into this, these people who bring offenses contrary to the doctrine, they're the ones trying to bring in some new shit. Trying to get some dirt on the guys, you know. This is why the scriptures say, from what you have learned, avoid them. Okay, stay away from them. Because they're trying to twist shit up. They're being an agent. Okay. They're trying to change the man them from what Yahweh Shimei Shai prescribed for you to do. Okay. So let's go back into this. Mm hmm. Let's 
Revelation 1 and 6 at Marvel that ye are soon, so soon removed from him that called you into the grace of Hamashiach unto another gospel, which is not another, but there be some that trouble you who would pervert the gospel of Hamashiach. But though we are an angel from heaven, preach any other gospel unto you than what which or slakia unto you than that which we have preached unto you, let him be a curse. As we have said before, so say I now, if any man preach any other gospel unto you, then that ye have received, let him be a curse. Okay? So you see these agents, they want to do that. They want to come in, be amongst the man them, and start pitching these little pennies in their two cent. You know, I think really... Mm, these are agents trying to draw a man from out the truth. For whatever purpose may be, draw them out the truth. Pull them back into that worldly mind, that worldly setting. At the same time of doing their job, whatsoever they, they were sent to do. Destroy that crew. Destroy it. We, we want them dismantled. Bring some new words in. Entice them. Your job is to go there. Learn this for the last five years, whatever. And then after that, six, seven years, start bringing in new doctrine. You know, and the guys who are close to you, get, get in their ear. You know? Guys who you know can drink, drink, drink. Bring, bring them, just, you know? <laughs> this, this is what the agents are hired to do, man. Throw you off. Make you teach something else. Destroy that, that little crew over there. We don't want them teaching them or dismantle them. Or we want some dirt on them. We want, we want them to do something dirty. We want them to get in a fight with this guy or that guy. Oh, when you guys go out there, you know, we're going to send out, send out our, our, our little 501c3ers. All I need you to do, brother, is just slap the brother's hand and it's on. Don't worry, they'll, they'll do their part. There's hired agents out there. Just because you see somebody in a garment... Kwam Yashrala! Yelling, bleeding from his eyes, screaming in. Alright? They are hired agents out there. Alright? And they're out there to make you go off from what you're doing. Okay? They're out there to throw you off. They're out there to throw you off. Slut looking right in my eyes, man. These girls are sluttish, man. Don't look a grown grown ass man in his eyes like that, bitch. If you, I don't know what's going on out here, man. But really, gross darkness, people, man. You know. You see what this bitch is wearing, but anyways, going back into this. You got these um. Like I said, you got these uh. uh agents out here trying to persuade you to push a different doctrine for whatever reason they're hired to make it happen they're make they're trying to make it happen you know that's why you gotta watch out for people you know listen to what they're saying don't just click walk away five minutes click click you know take in what they're saying just like when the apostles just tell you don't just fucking um don't just, um, what's the word? Don't just, um, <laughs> well, show off, eh? Anyways, don't just, uh, take our word for it. Go study the word. Go look in the word. All right? Anyways, let's go into the next scripture here. Yep. you going to come down on us. That's what these hired agents' job is to do. Hey, okay, didn't I have that up there? Sedition? Oh, well. Uh, 
um, Second Ezra 16 and uh, 70. There shall be in every place and in the next cities a great insurrection upon those that fear the Lord. They shall be like madmen, spearing none, but still spoiling and destroying those that fear the Lord. For, oh no, anyways, is that it? Yep. So, these FBI agents, these agents, they're going to have those lists. We already told you, brothers. They got your face, they got you. There's nowhere to run, okay? But this is the job of an agent. This is the job of these agents. And well, why do you think that they're going to find you with such ease? Why? Because you got a cell phone in your pocket? You took the M-Top? <laughs> no. And don't take the M-Top, first of all. But anyways, no. They, they already know you, man. There's nowhere to run. When they come down on the city, scoop everybody up, go to these concentration camps, which we've been telling you about, okay? We're the only spot. They're going to have food and water is at these concentration camps because they're going to lock off the, the, the supply. Remember, the Lord said, I'm going to make a famine of hearing this word. And there's going to be a famine of, of fucking bread, water, food, remnants, okay? There's going to be a time where men are going to be breaking into people's houses to get food and remnant. Y'all don't listen. That's, that's your fault. Y'all don't listen. So they're going to be going through the city, scooping everybody up. You think they're going to be going from door to door? Are hey, you crazy? How about Shim Yon Shai? What? Bam! <laughs> no. You know where they're going to do that? They're going to have the guillotines lined up. They're going to have the hanging stations lined up. They're going to have the torture stations lined up. They're going to have all these things lined up for the men of the Lord, those who serve you. How about Shim Yon Shai? And all these agents' jobs out here is to do is to sell us out. Give us up, you know, the black desk, pass that information more fluent so they know exactly what is up. Like a missile with that with that uh, beam spot, you know, boom. They want to know who is who. They're not even fucking playing. That's why it's written in the scriptures, okay? Continuing. For they shall waste and take away their goods and cast them out of their houses. Then shall then shall be known who are my chosen, and they shall be tried as gold in the fire. So, let me continue. Here, O ye, my beloved, saith the Lord, behold, the days of trouble are at hand. But I will deliver you from the same. Be not afraid, neither doubt, for God is your guide, and the guide of them who kept or slakia, who keep my commandments and precepts, saith the Lord God, saith the whole power. Okay. Let not your sins weigh you down, and let not your iniquities lift up themselves. Woe be unto them. That are bound with their sins and covered with their iniquities, like as a field is covered over with bushes, and the path thereof covered with thorns, that no man may travel through. Okay. So the days are a trouble at hand, man. How is it gonna be known? Because we're the ones who are gonna stand stiffly for the name of Yahweh Shem Yahushai, Lord will. Okay, those in Second Ezra tells you that stand so stiffly for the name of Yahweh Hashem Yahushai, those are going to be ones with the crowns on their head. Okay, in that Second Ezra to that chapter two, if I'm not mistaken. Hold up. So these agents, yep. Mm-hmm. There you go. Go read it if you want. So. Going back into this. Uh, oh, yeah. No, no, no. It is left undressed, and it is cast into the fire to be consumed there, therewith. Yeah, you two-thirds, you ain't keeping the Lord's precepts. 
you're not doing this work, you're gonna be you're gonna be bound and cast into the fire. When that second death come, you it's gonna touch you, okay? But anyways, um going back into this. Lord said that they're gonna be like mad men spearing none, okay? People think it's a joke. But anyways, going back into this, this is what these agents, agent provocateurs, agents, they're all here to try and get you on that list, man. If you're not already on the list, all right? This is this is the thing that these agents love to do and that they're about, okay? And the rest of you individuals, you just don't know. Because the Lord didn't give you that, that, that uh, you know, he didn't give you that in your mind, okay? He didn't give you that understanding. He didn't awake you, okay? Let's go back into something real quick here. Um, oh yeah, keep that up. First John two fifty. Uh, for uh, First John, chapter two and fifteen. Love not the world, neither things that are in in it. Love not the world, neither the things that are in the world. If any man love the world. The love of the Father is not in him, okay? Right. That agent stuff, let me get mine now. Let me live sweet. Let me get my constellation. All that's going to run out. And those who didn't keep the precepts, what? Just like I said, it says right here, woe we'll, we'll be unto them that are bound with their sins and covered with their iniquities. Like as a field is covered over with bushes and the path thereof covered with thorns that no man may travel through is left undressed and is cast into the fire to be consumed therewith. That's those agents. That's two thirds. Okay, because what? They love the world and the love of the father and son is not in them. All right. This is why, you know, they're gonna get destroyed, man. For all for all that is in the world, the lust of the flesh and the lust of the eyes, and the pride of life is not the is not the father, but is of the world. And these agents, they know that. Well, they might not know that. They think probably this is some kind of, you know, Black Panther thing or you know what I mean? They're probably in the mindset of that. Because truly, if they would know, like, you know, you have to know the Father. You know, he's got to reveal himself unto you in order for you to serve him. Was that John 6, 40, 44? No man could come unto me except the Father sent him. So, these people out here, man, hey, these hired agents, we, we know your tactics, man. We can see you from a mile away, okay? It's just, you know, these other guys over here, these whirly ass niggas, you know, they don't get it, but we do. John, uh, Romans 8 and 5, and 5, for they that are after the flesh do mind the things of the flesh, but they that are after the spirit, the things of the spirit. For to be carnally minded is death, but to be spiritually minded is peace, is life and peace, okay? And these uh, agents, they're after the things of the world. They're after the flesh, the lusts of this world, okay? Whatever they may have done, they fucked up, you know, they got arrested. Then they come to them and say, hey, I want you to be an agent against those black Hebrew Israelites, all right? Can you do it? You just got to get in there and infiltrate. That's your job. Get in there and infiltrate. We'll, we'll give you, the, we'll give you the, the rest after, all right? I just need you to get in there and infiltrate. All right, for now. And yeah, like I said, they're 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 carnal ass niggas, they're worldly ass niggas, man. They're they're not of you about Shimmy Oshai. Okay. So going back into this, uh Titus chapter one, fifteen, on to on to the pure, all things are pure, but unto them that are defiled, two thirds, these agents, okay. Defiled and unbelieving is nothing pure, but even their mind and conscience is defiled. Okay, yeah. 
Like I said, you can't serve your Alba Shimmy on Shine unless he calls you to come serve him, man. And you agents out there, you know, you see us on the highways and byways. As it says, not, this ain't pure unto you, man. Just like the Father said, my word is pure. Okay? Proverbs chapter 30 and, and, and 5. So unto you agents, you, you see this. You say, ah, they ain't worth, they ain't worthy, man. I'll go, yeah, yeah, I'll go against them. I'll go against them. Yeah, 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 I'll get in there. What you want me to do? You want me to plant some cocaine up in there? You want, you want me to get one of them doing some cocaine on uh, on video? You know? You want me to get them drunk? That's why I just jab them with this needle shit. Like, trust me, you need to stay away from those type of people in the world, man. That's why we say keep company with those, you know, we don't beg no new friend. Keep company with those you know, man. Yeah, not in the world, in this truth, okay? We don't beg no new friend. Yeah, I'm good, I'm good on my own, man. We don't beg no new friend, <laughs> you know? But anyways, even that artist, what is his name, Popcorn, you say, yo, careful who you send for your drink, your food, all them thing there. <laughs> Think say a joke. On a joke, man. Here, here comes back the agent again. Let me see what he blasting again. So, anyways, let's uh, let's go to Ezra. You already know about this one right here, Ezra. Right now, blast no music, huh? Ezra 4 and 4, then the people of the land, weak in the hands of the people of Judah. Let me start again. Then the people of the land, weak in the hands of the people of Judah, and troubled them in building, and hired counselors against them to frustrate their purpose all the days of Cyrus, king of Persia, even until the reign of Darius of Persia. Okay. Yeah, I wrote accusations against us lies you know well some of the you know some of the things yeah because of wicked ass israelites it was written so that's why we have these scriptures because they search these scriptures right and these scriptures are also um record keeping you know records that's why it says roman 15 and 4 these things are written a four time for what for our learning so we could go through this and know hey see this is what happened in the past you see that you see that you know, the Lord won't leave us um, empty, okay? He won't leave us dumbfounded, okay? That's why the Lord said that he gave us teachers that should not be removed into a corner no more. But this word, this word, you can hear this word, okay? And this this is what's going to save us, the spirit of Yahweh Shem Yoshai. Not some dude with a gun. You know, or some dude with a bomb. We put our trust into Yahweh Shem Yahushai. You know, and all, all the works that you agents are going to be seen. Your ass is going to be shown, okay? And you're going to do nothing. As it says, you have no power against me unless the Most High will it. As a matter of fact, let's get that real quick. You could have no power against me unless the Most High grant that bomb up that for you. You hear? John 19 and 10. Then Pilate said unto him, Speakest thou not unto me? Knowest thou not that I have power to crucify thee, and have power to release thee? Yahweh shall answer, Thou couldst have no power at all against me, except it were given thee from above. Therefore he that have delivered me unto you have the greater sin. Yeah, you could have no power, unless the Most High sanction it, Go on with your rough talk. Go on with your bold faces. You know? Go on with all that shit you talk. It's okay. Alright? Romans 15 and 4. For whatsoever things were written aforetime were written for our learning. Whatsoever things were written aforetime were written for our learning. Say it one more time. Whatsoever things were written aforetime were written for our learning that we through patience and comfort of the scriptures might have hope okay so whatsoever things were written aforetime guess what 
They're written about these these agents, how they come out Ezra, you know, how they came out trying to stop us then. You know, many things. But guess what? Hold strong to your faith. And hold strong to, to, to putting that trust into Yahweh Shem Yahushai. As it says, has any come to serve the Lord? And he said, nah, fuck you. And threw you to the side? No. You came and you did this in honesty, truth, and sincerity. Lord, got your back. Was that Hebrews uh, 6 and 10? Sirach 2 and 10? Okay. So that's why we do this unto the Lord in all honesty, truth, and sincerity. Because we know at the end of the year, day, and week, the Lord has us. He's got our back. Okay. At the end of the year, day, and week. And we ain't selling out for no crumbs. We don't want your dainty things. Riches certainly make themselves wings and fly to heaven. It takes an integral man. That's why we pray unto Yahweh Shem Yahushai. Don't cast the spirit away from us. Please, please, please. Do not cast your Holy Spirit away from us. Because we're going to walk like these retards in the world. These slow of minded individuals. We don't care about your FRNs. Your 501c3s. We're not making a pack with the man. We're not pulling no agent behaviors. Okay? Because you got to think at the end of the year, day, and week, integrity. To be an integral individual, it takes a lot. So, hey, man. With that, all praises, all honor, all glory be unto Yahweh. Bahashem Yahweshai. Bahashem Rokakodash. Double honors to the Apostle Elders of Green Millstone that rule well. And peace and salutation to all the Akim doing and pushing this word. In all honesty, truth, and sincerity worldwide. And a sincere shalom to the elect. Okay? I hope you're edified, Lord willing. Till the next time. Shalom. And a bad babal.